So good to see you nice again. To see you. Louisa did just an amazing job on my teeth. And so I'm just hoping and I'm trusting in her to be able to help Abe in some way. This guy has really, really bad teeth. And so I wanted to see if you could look at them and okay. tell us what needs to be fixed. Okay. Let me get everything ready and okay. then I'll come and get you. All right, okay. thank you. Oh, she's so beautiful. She is so beautiful. Wow. Okay. She ended so much pain for me. Every time I smile, I think of her. And I didn't want to smile for years. Ready? Let's go. I am in a lot of pain, I am. But as the man of the house, you don't show your pain. You know, that's one of them things growing up Amish that you get. You know, you don't show your emotions. And if you have pain, so what? Nobody cares. And it's just one of them things where you figure out how to deal with it. Let me take a look. Tooth number three has a lot of decay. Second tooth number two also has a lot of decay. Some of the teeth are so decayed that nothing can be done anymore. They have to be removed. I don't know how he's able to eat because he has what we call rampant decay, which is, you know, uncontrolled decay. It's like a bomb exploded in each one of these teeth. It's definitely something that can be fixed. It's gonna take a little bit of work. I think the Amish community is a bit behind when it comes to dental treatment. I just can't believe this goes on in the United States. This goes on in third world countries.